a suffix goes at the beginning or end of a word? End. The end, right. So we are going to be adding suffixes to our root words today and making some new words. Can someone tell me a root word and a suffix that can go together and what that new word would be? Brittany. Play. Say it again. Play. Play. What else? What's the suffix? Full. Full. That new word would be? Full. All right. Yes, Norlin. Make sure we're using each root word at least once. Uh, Kennedy. Say that again. use that way. I don't know if that would be considered a good suffix for that base word. Dahlia. Say it. That would be called edible, so they don't really say it's eatable. They say it's edible. Yeah, well, ed is not in there. Edib edible. Uh, Marcos? Say it again. Kind is not in there. Manuel? Color and full. Color and full. Uh, we've done two folds. Let's try to find something different. Jackson? Kicking. Kick, kick ing. Good. We did two ings, so let's try to find a different suffix. I know. Arlette? Swimmed, that, the past tense is swam. We gotta be careful with these because they don't always work. Brittany, say it again. Cooked, cook with an ed. Cook, ed, cooked. Another one, Yuritza. Um, quickly. Quickly, yes, quickly. Quick, Lee, quickly. Eliana? Um, exciting or excited. We already used ing and ed, and let's try to find one uh, that could work with another one. We have er, ment, we have able. Go ahead. Reader, right? That's good. Reader, read, er, reader. 
Oh, we've already used kick. Let's see, we used color, we used play, we used kick, we used eat, we used quick, we used cook. Did we use commit? No. What would be commit? What would commit go with? Zoe? Committing? Oh, we used ink twice already. Is there something else we could use it with? Oh, you're right. We didn't use kick. What? I'm going to... I'm going to talk to you about this one. We have commit oh, and meant. Commitment. Commitment. All right. And you're right. We did not do kick yet. So we could do. Somebody mentioned it, but I didn't write it down because we had that. Kick could work with ED. I and G, E R. So why don't we do with E R? Kicker. The kicker. All right. We did not use excite. We did not use excite, nor did we use able. So what could we do? What could we say? We could say excitable. Excitable. Uh, you're gonna have to add this one because those the, that's one is the one we didn't add as a suffix. Make it on the bottom, on the or something. At least add excitable and commitment. Those two should be added because you didn't use those suffixes at all, and you used some a couple times. Yes, Rama. Excitement would also work, but since we had commitment. We just did excitable. But yes, you could have excitement as well. All right. So with those words, what you're going to do, just like yesterday, hold on. Just like yesterday, you're going to choose five new words with the suffixes, write them in sentences using what they truly mean, right? Then two other words and draw what they uh, draw an illustration, right? You're going to illustrate what those mean as well. So you're going to pick seven nice. words, new words, right? From here, five for the sentences, two for the illustrations. Oh. Just like we did yesterday with the prefixes, we're now doing the suffixes.